Hello and welcome again in this lecture and this lecture is about the BACS. So what is BACS? BACS is uh, building automation systems or we can say building automation and control systems and these are also type of OT systems and uh, they are commonly used for in buildings for heating, ventilation, air conditioning or in short you can say HVAC. Uh, fire, electrical, lighting, physical access controls, physical security and other utility systems. So if you see most of the modern buildings contain some form of building automation systems. It could be a smaller, uh, it could be on the smaller um, uh, quantum or, or it can be on a, a bigger large scale as well depending on the building architecture as well as uh, as well as the uh, type of automation what what has been implemented there so um, older buildings and equipments may have been retrofitted with new systems it is also possible but uh, it is there in almost all, all of the buildings so some of the most common functions of building automations are maintaining the environmental conditions for occupant comfort reducing energy consumption reducing operating and maintenance cost, increasing security, uh, recording historical data, temperature, humidity, and performing general equipment monitoring. So these are some, some of the functions of building automation system. So basically the architecture control network architecture of building automation looks like this. So they will have a field, field layer uh, uh, where where all all those VAV box, air handler, boiler, badge reader, wireless sensor, all the field related equipments will decide. Then we'll have the automation layer where automation uh, controllers will decide. Then we have a supervisory layer where we will see supervisory application setting. And then finally we have uh, enterprise layer uh, at the top so basically environmental controller sensors can provide the temperature and humidity uh, temperature and humidity to to the building controller if the build sensor values are outside the set points uh, the controller can signal a VAV, VAV box VAV is variable air volume box to increase or decrease the air flow and bring the temperature to the desired state so similarly a building equipment is scanning their identification badge identification badge at the badge reader can result in the credentials being sent to the access controller and then access controller and application controller server determine whether whether access should be granted or not so uh, this type of applications will be there this type of use cases will be there for uh, for building automation systems and uh, similar type of uh, network segmentation or the cyber security controls we can implement for these uh, systems what are in what are uh, uh, available there so if these are windows related system we need to find uh, we need to uh, design a solution which which is uh, compatible to the windows systems if, if the, these are proprietary controls then we'll need to see what type of cyber security controls we can implement so uh, for building automation systems also it is a threat to life or uh, or health and safety impact as well because if someone uh, plays around with uh, the BSEA system, yeah, it can impact the uh, quality uh, of stay at the at the building. Like if someone increases the temperature or someone disables the uh, air conditioning or someone um, switches off the all the lights of the building. So so these types of hacks can be happen or or might be possible that someone is utilizing the processing and compute power of the building devices for uh, Bitcoin or crypto coin mining. So these types of attacks we have seen earlier and we have a reference of all those things. So that, that's why it is also important to protect this BSEA system as it has all, all the four things can be impacted like health and safety impact it could have the uh, financial impact in case of uh, loss of some of the services uh, billing services or uh, the food and uh, restaurant services or even state services um, other other could be uh, the um, reputation impact so if some some company big brand now getting hacked and they are in the BSEA systems or some hotels or some organizations hacked so there will be an impact also on on the reputation of that company 
so uh, this is a like high level overview of bscs and uh, i think hope it it gave you a good uh, understanding that how does it looks like how does building automation looks like so it's a simple and it's just uh, we can say similar to dcs because they have a, they have also a distributed uh, control system and and we can be visualized from a central uh, location and and can be managed from a central location also so that's all about BACS. Thank you.